Good morning, everyone. We are headed to Karuna today. You want to tell me about Karuna? Uh, yeah, it's a very north city in Sweden. It's inside the Arctic Circle. Mm -hmm. um, it's a mining town. Yeah, I think it's like the biggest iron ore mine in Europe. Yeah, it's something like that. Yeah, so we're going up there for just a couple nights, and then we'll train down one night. And mm -hmm. we're going to try to vlog as much as we can, but who knows what we'll end up getting because it is perpetually dark up there. There's no sunlight right now. Let's go for polar night. Let's yeah. go. We're also going to be there during the like equinox like or like the shortest the, the solstice the solstice the very shortest day of the year so i mean like it's already dark so i can't imagine yeah it's gonna be trippy we're gonna see what it's like but we're definitely gonna take you along and we hope you enjoy it open eye feel the waves cut through me hypnotized by the sounds I'm breathing in Hold tight, hold tight Can't make coast collide Hold tight, hold tight Hold tight Dripping lights Paint the skies All because of you Dripping lights Paint the skies Okay, here we go Stepping in the door, we have a fridge that has nowhere to plug in, but they gave us another fridge. We have our coats stored that we need to kind of, we need to finish getting out our scarves and our winter boots because I wore tennis shoes like a dummy. I wore boots. And like he a wore boots because I packed my tennis shoes in there, or my, my winter boots are in there. The bathroom. Okay, I will stop doing that accent now. Then we have our tiny little, little bitty bedroom, but it's fine. Here's what must have happened. That fridge it, over there, we were trying, we we probably looked for five minutes of, for where to plug that in. Can't find it. But then you walk in here and this one's just sitting on the floor, not bolted down. <laughs> so they must have realized their error later and just given you a separate fridge on the floor. It works, it works. Let's see, oh God. Let's see if there's, oh, you have like a little, a little view. Wow. We have this very Swedish is light in the window. Boat? That is someone's this boat. This is someone's boat. It is covered, covered in snow. In we get our own blankies, but it looks like it's one bed. So that'll be nice because actually right now, Bo and I sleep on two separate beds that are, try we tried to bolt them together, but <laughs> yeah. yeah, it's not the best. Maybe we should unpack, get some groceries. I need some soda and then Coffee. Yeah, and then we will just chill. Okay, you can totally see the indentation from my like, my like, furry hat. What is it called? Toboggan. Toboggan. That's what it's called. We decided to just walk to the nearby Ica because we didn't feel like walking around to find a restaurant, especially since we're just dying to like change into our swimsuits and go to the pool downstairs indoor. The plan for this weekend is kind of like staycation, like hang out, watch TV in the, in the room. We have some tours booked tomorrow and the next day, but other than that, we're really just kind of hoping to lazy around. But I'll show you our little grocery haul of what, like our makeshift charcuterie board here. So we have grapes, three different kinds of cheeses, and two different kinds of crackers, and a lot of salami and type meats, Ooh. and some garlic. Oh my God, I, I, I haven't tried that, I'm really excited. And then we got, for dessert, what do we got? Some, oh, yeah. some, Vanilla. Those are for me. Yeah, vanilla. vanilla. I haven't had tried. I tried the cinnamon ones, but not that. And then what the heck is this? They're like wafers. Oh, like, that's uh... cute. So we're about to do, about to turn on some good place and just hang out, and then we're going to the pool. Um, there's no lights in here, but this is a very cool pool area. Can you even see it? It's so neat. Really dark, but there's like a seating area up on a deck, and then obviously the pool. And then you turn over here, and it's just a lot of snow. Morning. Morning, day two. We forgot to close out last night. So last night we did, um, we tried to get in the pool. You were brave enough to jump in and it was really cold. So I was like, no, thank you. I got in the shower and then we got in the sauna or like the, the steam room. Yeah. 
Um, I, we, we have rendered a guess that we're sitting right above the steam room because our floor feels heated and I'm 100% sure that these floors are not yeah. heated. But um, that's kind of nice. So today we're gonna go eat some breakfast and then hang out around the apartment, or around the apartment, around the hotel for a little while. And then we have dog sledding tonight. It'll be fun, see some puppies. That's it. Maybe some Aurora. It's yeah. supposed to be cold today. I hope the clouds go away so that we can actually see it, yeah. <laughs> Okay, it's like not quite 12 o'clock noon, and I think this is peak what we're gonna see daylight here today, which honestly is a lot more than I thought it would be, and I'm a little disappointed. Like, I kinda wanted it to be dark all day. I thought we were like north enough that like literally it wouldn't be bright at all, but, but with all the snow, it is quite bright. But really, today is the winter solstice, so it is literally the shortest day of the year. We'll enjoy this little bit of sun, and then it'll go away probably about an hour, and then it'll be dark again. So, we got dressed. How many layers do you have on? One, two, three, four, five. <laughs> I have three pairs of pants on, and my snow boots with thermal socks, and I have three shirts on. So, I have one more layer than he does. We're going to just see, because we're going to go dog sledding tonight, like I said, probably for the 20th time in this dang vlog. We're going to go dog sledding tonight. So, this will be a good, we're just going to go walk around. This will be a good chance to figure out if we have enough layers on for tonight. I think we have plenty. So, we're just going to go explore for a little bit. Make it last forever. Stop inside. Again, I think my camera's all fogged up because our room is definitely over the like sauna down below. So Bo went to go get us some Thai food because it's right next door. And we got freaked out because we thought that they just handed us like frozen dinner meals because of the way that it's packaged. See, the way that it's packaged like looks like you could just like pop this in a microwave, but it's definitely warm and there's definitely like a fresh lemon wedge in here. So <laughs> they must just have something to like package it up this way which was interesting. But yeah, we are back from our walk. I'm showered, we're gonna eat, watch one more Mandalorian, and then I think we'll get ready and walk to the guide tour office where we're gonna do our tour tonight. Literally 30 minutes later, getting on all of our layers, we're, we're somewhat dressed. Although, you should get a load of like, I look like I've doubled in size. I quite possibly have indeed doubled in size for my layers. What about you? Yeah, it's quadruple. <laughs> Oh my god! 
Having a stick, you you hold the weight so he can stick it down. Yeah. If we go back, you can rise his left. Oh yeah, yeah. Hundred <laughs> percent. He's got it now. Did you drive us? How far? I did. Yeah, How? it was yeah three three and three quarters miles. We yeah, did it. thank you. Six kilometers. <laughs> no sweat. Were we heavy? <laughs> no. Barely an inconvenience. <laughs> Pair of jeans, a shirt or two We didn't pack as if we weren't and going back It doesn't matter if it's true I've got a feeling You both did great jobs Thank you so much Thank you so much Thank you so much, we are You did a good job too You did a good job too Oh, you ready to go, aren't you? You ready to go, aren't you? Okay, we're all packed up. We have to layer up because it is colder today than it was yesterday. Even. Oh yeah. So we have an ice hotel tour today and then we'll check out ice hotel and then we'll have to walk down to the train station which will be cold I'm sure. And then we leave tonight on a train, an overnight train home. Yeah, 14 hour train. Oh my God. <laughs> the world is waiting up. The world is waiting half a step beyond our door yeah. And if it's not enough I wanna see the stuff the world has got in store oh. I wanna take it all in, I'm falling The cityscape by night, wanna catch in my photos Where you go, every corner twice as bright There'll be my treasures forever When I can't hold you tight, I'll see the Stockholm lights Stockholm lights, the Stockholm lights. Stockholm lights, the Stockholm lights. Stockholm lights, the Stockholm lights. Tomorrow feels a year away, like the seconds, the beginning and the end. But if in time it's yesterday Your picture's gonna bring it home to me again The world is waiting up The world is waiting half a step beyond our door oh, And if it's not enough I wanna see the stuff the world has got in store I wanna take it all in, I'm falling The cityscape by night, wanna catch in my photos Where you go, every corner twice as bright There'll be my treasures forever When I can't hold you tight, I'll see the Stockholm lights The Stockholm lights, the Stockholm lights finally on our train we're gonna be here I guess like 20 more minutes before the train actually pulls off which gives mm -hmm. us time to get settled yeah. we kind of need to get our pajamas like out and that way we can put away bags and brush our teeth we have like a little sink that we can brush our teeth in right there so what we decided to do we flew up here but we decided it would kind of be a fun experience to take an overnight train all the way from Karuna to Uppsala and you told me that when we get to Uppsala it like stops and you have like two minutes to get oh, on. Oh yeah, we got like, like two minutes. Literally two minutes, so that'll be an experience. But when we booked our tickets, 
the tickets were sold out for first class, like the sleeper cabins. So we had to go with the second class sleeper cabin, which thankfully they live, they give you the option to like buy it out. So there's not like a third random, random person staying in here. They would literally be like right here. This thing folds down, which I do yeah, not know how you would bunk, sleep. One bunk, two bunks, and then the yeah. bunk we're sitting on. <laughs> yeah. So like, I mean like one bunk, two bunks, three bunks. Like I do not know how we would fit a third person here. So thankfully it's just me and you. Yeah. It is tinier than I expected. I don't know about it you. It is exactly as tiny as I expected. <laughs> well, let's settle in. We got 15 hours to go. Yeah, it's going to be an experience. So we're going to get comfy. Okay, we are home safe and sound. I'll close this video out here because we have a lot of unpacking to do, showering to do, and then relaxing to do. Thank y'all so much. I hope you enjoyed it.